Hey everyone, Jonathan and Molly here, and welcome back to Savoring the Magic, where we believe there is magic in the details. That's right, and we are here at Epcot today, which has some of our favorite Christmas details out of all of Walt Disney World. We have Festival of the Holidays, we have the Candlelight Processional, we have some holiday overlays on attractions. True. So we are gonna show you guys all of that today. So come along with us on this excursion. All right, so first things first, we gotta go see Figment in his holiday attire, which is the only change to that ride, to That's be true. fair. But. And if your name is George, your family is looking for you. Loudly, in fact, whistling and everything. You've, you're missed, you're missed. And we're passing by the Moana meet and greet area here, That's right. right outside of the seas. And I've actually been refurbishing the seas over here. The, the seagulls are back and the murals were freshly painted. And this is actually closer to the, the building color that it originally was in mm -hmm. 81. So I'm hoping it stays that way. Water's still not back because you can just hear the jet firing. <laughs> Makes it very exciting. Oh, yeah. My preferred weight for this attraction? <laughs> None. None, yes. Five minutes. Five minutes. Quote yeah. unquote. <laughs> I told you not to interfere. But you've got it wrong, Doc. It's not about listening with your ears. It's about listening with your imagination. For every sound, your ears are hearing. A thousand thoughts can start appearing. turning this entire open house upside down. Upside down? Now you're talking. That's the best idea you've had all day. With just a spark of inspiration, I made my house an innovation. Imagination really comes around. And now that song will follow you home. So true. It will be stuck in our heads for the rest of the day. Yes. Although, I must say, the one thing that I did think about while we were writing it with the Christmas sweater is why don't they make that and sell that for adults? I don't know. Like, it's like an Epcot yeah. themed, like, blue Christmas sweater, as you just saw. I'm like, they would make a killing on that if they actually sold that. See? You're good, Bob. You're welcome. Merchandise the opportunity. Like, you don't have enough of those already. Also, we pointed out walking out, they really should have the figment meet and greet. With, with the, the Christmas with the sweater, sweater, yeah. He's just in the regular old yellow sweater right yeah. now. So, which is fine, you know. Yeah. But, it's Christmas. He should look Christmassy. That's true. And then we're going to pop in Creation Shop real quick, take a look at some of the merch here. For That's right. Festival the holiday. This has been out for a little bit, but this is the first time we've seen it. Yeah. It's like the general look. I like the Pretty coloring. Cool. Yeah, the coloring is cool. I don't know how much I love the animation style, but I like the coloring. And they have the jacket. Mickey! Yeah, it's cute with Mickey. Of course, the corresponding ears. I do like the stitching on the ears. Yeah, the stitching is cool. It's simple, I like the front. It's okay. What I really like is just, just that, that on the shirt. <laughs> yeah. Well, we own this. <laughs> yes, we, we own that. Yeah. Which holds no cookies. It just sits the decorative That's thing on our shelf. True. And then if you actually wanted to get a decorative figurine of Spaceship Earth, it will cost you more <laughs> than the yeah, cookie jar will. That's true. You just get the cookie jar. 
I mean, I'm not going to say it's necessarily a pro tip, but it's kind of a pro tip. Christmas things. So we came in here for festival merch, but all we've found so far are just other things to get distracted by. Yes. Like it's the Hanukkah cool, merch. Cool Hanukkah merch, though. It is. Yeah, normally I feel like the festival merch is in here, but... Maybe they moved it out. Maybe we are incorrect. I do really like the Marvel Holiday yeah. merch here. Very simple. They have that. Also the matching hat. Matching hat. That's really cute. Stocking. Ooh. It's pretty cool. I like that as well. With the Avenger eggs. That's very That's cute. That's real cute. And even complete with a couple ornaments here. And the kids sweater. Oh, that's cute. That's cute. Yeah, I like all this. And we have found the festival holiday merch. I like my friend. Yeah. It has that fuzzy bottom. <laughs> oh, I do generally like that. Yeah, I do too. I like the raised uh, yeah, country. Country. That's really neat. This is pretty. Yeah, I like that. Uh, the cookie stroll, cookie very jar. Neat. I'll tell you, this is a Pork very cool forksicle. Yeah, I like that a lot. Yeah, me too. That's unfortunate. Unfortunate problem. Yeah. It is a cute mug. I like this a lot. I don't need another mug. I'm if I showed you, all, you we our have cabinet. Like 5,000 mugs at home. It's an illness. There's a bag, too. It's cute. It feels very uh, German. It does. Like Germany Pavilion. I Ooh. like that, too. Oh, did you see the front? So here's the back. It's the back. I like that a lot. Look at the front. Oh, uh, bag gun. <laughs> You heard it here first. Dagum. Dagum. It's real. So that's the Passover pin. Oh, that's real cute too. That is nineteen ninety nine. Well, they like that a lot. <laughs> so here are just non pass holder pins. Okay. Also very cute though. And then they also have the ornaments. Very cool. That's pretty. I really like the coloring and the logo this year. Mm -hmm. So as usual in leading up to filming here, we were trying to read up on the festival itself. Yep. And the name, you know, International Festival of Holidays or whatever, didn't come about until I think it was 2016. But they've been doing Christmas stuff here at Epcot since like 1996. And which we were talking about the other day, like we remember coming to the Candlelight Processional as kids. Oh, yeah. I mean, that was something that we, if we were down here for Christmas, pretty much, we were in Epcot and we were doing that. Yeah. I very distinctly remember Gary Sinise as the celebrity narrator. Well, I don't think they had as many narrators <laughs> yeah. as they do now, or at least I don't remember them. Yeah, them. which I feel like now it probably lasts a little longer, yeah. too. Not that it lasts a long time, because Festival of the Holidays is short, but... Um, By comparison to the rest of them. Yeah, yeah, for sure. Fill us with the light. Fill us with the light, oh, fill us with the light, oh, Always good to hit uh, a joyful uh, yes. performance. We caught the tail end of their final performance, so yeah. go us. <laughs> That's right. So we are 
headed over to see Father Christmas. That's right. Over in the UK pavilion. I kind of forget about it until we get here every year of how much I love the storytellers. I know. I feel like they really are a huge benefit to coming out to Festival of the Holidays. Yeah. Like it's one of the best parts. And we just obviously we just saw Father Christmas and the guy doing it was so great. Spot on. Oh my gosh. We're gonna try to catch a couple more yes. as we mosey through the other countries. I know. I know. Some of these are uh, quite unique and yes. <laughs> to put it delicately uh, <laughs> yes. in a great way yes but we're excited Can we all say this? Bonjour! Bonjour! And as we say in my country, Shuaya Noel. Please come in a little, eh? Come! We are friends, are we not? What's in that? Let me. Do you know who I am? Some people call me Santa, but here in France, I am Le Père Noël, Father Christmas. I am the good spirit of the season. Ah, it is a joy for me to see all of you in such good spirits. But now, I have another question for you. Have any of you, oh, your pet is also, have you ever written a letter to my friend Santa at the North Pole? Mm -hmm. You big people, yes, you can admit this too. <laughs> well, in France, if a child writes a letter to me, tell the way, and puts a return address on the envelope, the French government pays the postage on my reply. Not bad, eh? I get so many letters. I would like to share with you one of my favorite. It come to me from a lovely 
little girl. He does not believe in Christmas. He does not believe in the world. But for me, nothing surpasses the, the magic of the first night, of the fragile beauty of a child's face on Christmas morning. I know, with Christmas still several days away, Uncle Louis secretly decorated the tree, and Francois and Babette to set up the crash. For Christmas last year, we should have get yet another Santa to put into the nativity scene, as if they too was going to worship the baby Jesus. It's a nice custom. Eh? Now, last year, Babette was finally old enough to go to midnight mass with Uncle Louis. Ah. <laughs> As Uncle Louis carried a newborn lamb to the priest to symbolize the lamb of God and then put it into a little cap for Babette to pull around the church for everyone to see with shepherds playing flutes and drums. Then, after the mass, they go home for le réveillon, the big supper. Who likes to meet at Christmas time, huh? Who likes to meet all the time, huh? <laughs> Monsieur, we French are not different. <laughs> Some of the coolest Christmas decorations in the France Pavilion are these little vignettes of places around France decorated. All right, so we got distracted <laughs> and we got a salmon latke, the standard potato latke, and a black and white cookie because... Why not? Why not? It, they just look so good. So they, this is how that happens. So taste test incoming. Yes. Same. Mm. All right, we're trying the original block. Yes. The OG, if you will. These are always a favorite, so. These came out fresh. By the way, we had to kind of wait for them for a second. It's always worth it. And this sour green thing that they put on here, it is just happiness. So, if you love potatoes, yes, you should do this. So good. Is it as like, good as you remembered? <laughs> it's even better than I remembered, I think, possibly. That's because he never has smoked salmon anymore, so this is a real treat. Yeah, there's a lot of salt in smoked salmon, so usually I don't partake. However, it's the holidays. So good. Cheers. Cheers. I don't think we ever talked about it, but that black and white cookie was incredibly good. Oh, yeah. Here's the Christmas tree over in the American Pavilion. Of course, the pavilion like itself is decorated as well. Very soon, we'll be over at the Candlelight Procession. It's very true. to the stage, the Voices of Liberty, and the Epcot Candlelight Processional.
please welcome this evening's special guest narrator, Bart Millard. Well, good evening, everyone, and welcome. I can't tell you how excited I am to be a part of this. A couple of days ago, I didn't know I was gonna be a part of this. Um, got the call that someone wasn't able to be here, and I got called up, and my kids could not be happier. So uh, thanks for making their Christmas come true. Uh, my kids asked, who are, you, who are you filling in for? I said, well, it's Simu Lu. It was a Marvel hero. And they were like, oh, we wanted to see him. I was like, no, no. If he was here, we would, you know what, never mind. It's, sorry, it didn't work out. But uh, I'm not sure if you know, but Walt Disney began the tradition of the candlelight processional at Disneyland over 60 years ago. In the time since, literally millions of guests have enjoyed the Christmas story, the traditional carols, and especially the glorious music of the holiday season. To continue this marvelous heritage, I invite you to sit back and enjoy our magnificent orchestra and these incredible singers. Jesus Christ found it in his earthly heart to give of himself to the people who loved him and even to the people who betrayed him, to all people. That a baby in a manger could grow to become a man who taught a world of people what it means to love one another.
we hope you guys enjoyed celebrating Christmas in Epcot with us. Have you ever been here during the holidays? If so, what are some of your favorite parts? Comment and let us know. That's right. If you enjoyed the video, be sure to like, comment, subscribe. It really helps us out. We have videos coming out every Wednesday and Saturday. But until next time, keep, keep savoring, savoring the magic. magic.